Hello ladies and gentlemen, and in today's video, I'm going to be showing you how you can use any of your old Android devices that has either a micro USB or a USB-C uh, adapter or <clears throat> and you can use it to basically make a desktop like experience without having to buy a flagship phone that has DeX or you know, Mot Motorola's um, ready for. You, know, you can do this with any old Android tablet or uh, Android phone and you can get a desktop like experience. So let me show you what you need. You need to buy some equipment of course for this but it's not it's not expensive. The first thing you need is this, this little cord right here. Okay I'm going to leave a link in the description because there are a lot of copies and if you get the wrong one uh, this tutorial won't work. Okay I, I'm I basically bought it and tested it out on a whim and I wasn't sure if it was going to work. As you can see it's connected to a uh, old tablet over here. Uh, this is like a 2016 uh, tab A. All right, And it's basically what this allows you to do is it allows you to cast onto an HDMI. Now for this case I used a, a converter. You may or may not have to do that. But if you you know if you want to go direct if you have a connection for uh, HDMI, you can go ahead and, and uh, connect it directly in. But in my case, I had a mini HDMI adapter, so I had to go ahead and plug that in. And then once everything's plugged in and you just install the app, you'll basically get a mirroring effect. And in order to finish off everything to get the desktop experience, you simply need to go and install an app. Let me uh, bring it up right here. It is called Taskbar, right? So it's this one right here. And once you install that, it will allow you to get this little desktop-like experience. Now you're gonna have to play around with it, all right? But you know, when you open up uh, tools, in, some of it might not be you know, perfectly optimized. You're going to have to play around with it, but it basically gives you a desktop like experience. You know, you can go ahead and type what you need to, and you get like a second use out of your old electronics. Now, uh, there's, a, there's a lot of misinformation going on where people say, oh, you should, you know, use your old Android devices as a security camera, but I'm here to tell you that doesn't work. And the reason why is because your battery will overheat if you keep plugging your Android in. An Android device in all the time and your your battery will start getting bloated and that can be a fire hazard so don't don't listen to everything you you see on uh, or hear on on the media including what I'm saying I, by, by what I uh, everything I've said I, I mean this works for me okay but um, you know it may not work for for you uh, I just wanted to do this because um, I think that older devices are you know a perfect candidate for this let's say you can't afford a flagship phone and you want to get more like life out of your phone without having to pay a thousand dollars or eight hundred dollars you can buy maybe a five hundred dollar four hundred dollar um, budget phone you can buy this cable plug it in get it mirrored and once you have it mirrored you can uh, attach a bluetooth and mouth right now i only have a, a mouse attached all right let me just show you right here all right so the mouse is only uh, connected to Bluetooth, but you can also do a, a keyboard, you can get a, a laptop, whatever the case may be, and then you can convert it into a kind of like a mini PC. Now this would be also be good for kids, if you have kids that, uh, you know, they need to upgrade the smart TV function on their TV, now you can also do it like that. But uh, I, I've also, I just wanted to, to share this uh, solution because um, I've seen other solutions, especially one from, uh, I think it was ETA Prime, and I love I love his content. He had another solution that used, um, I think it was like a dock, a certain dock, but the problem with his solution was that uh, it didn't supply any power to the connecting device. This solution right here does. As you can see, it's charging, all right? So you don't have to worry about this running out of battery, and it's cheaper, uh, in, in, my, in my case, it's, it's cheaper just to buy this cord than to have to lug around a dock, all right? So 
Um, that, that's just my solution. If you have any questions, comments, and concerns, you can leave them in the comment section below. Thank you so much for watching, and I'll see you in the next video.